Hey teacher, so I am back. I'm going to create for you guys this time a question and this is even easier. You're going to create and instead of creating an assignment, you can create quizzes just the way, same way that I did the assignment. It gives you other options for multiple choice or open-ended questions. Um, here I'm going to do the question which is the very, very simple one and I have a question that I'm going to put in here and my instructions I'm going to say, um, oops, sorry. And I always do this to remind the kids where to put their answer in. And I've put here short answer. And here I can put a due date again. Just I'm going to choose the same due date time. Um, and then here is where you can add. If you want to add um, a link, maybe you want them to read a something, an article off of another web page. You want to include a file that you have. Or you want to link a YouTube video to your assignment. Um, very simple, you just click on them, you add them. Um, here, I'm just gonna do the question. This is one question, that's it. I'm gonna ask it. And again, I'm gonna go to my student page because uh, I want you guys to see what that looks like. Okay, so here's my new assignment. See if I can find it. Okay, so here's my question that was asked in the student's um, account, I'm sorry, they're going to click view the question and all they're going to see is view the question. This is the question that I asked and it says answer in your work box. And you want to put this because sometimes the kids want to answer in the comments, but that's not where you want it. You want it in your work box. And I've taught my kids that this is their work box. So they go here, they type whatever they're going to type and they turn in and they're done. Super, super simple. Um, and again, if I go back into my teacher account, I can go into that assignment and I can see one person has turned it in. I go to it and I can see this is their answer. Obviously, did not answer correctly. I can give that person a zero and saving the grade. So um, what other thing I can do is it's already clicked. I can return this assignment, do it again, and I can write here a message for them to do again. So super simple. That's how you ask a question and each student, you will see their responses here. You can even set it up um, in your settings if you want them to see each other's responses and they won't be able to see each other's responses until they post their response first. So that's a really cool thing about it too. Thanks for watching.